here's a quick update for my JBJ 28 gallon this is the first video I'm taking with the daylights off and the dusk dawn lights on um, unfortunately the camera cannot really capture some of the fluorescence and some of the stunning lights um, and the colors that uh, can be seen but nevertheless I thought it would be uh, an interesting addition to my video log so it has been over a hundred days or three months since the tank has been up um, I'm gonna give a better overview of the changes in my next video but we can see the uh, fire shrimp or the blood shrimp uh, has come out. I've added two clowns um, and instead of the one that I've lost to the open brain coral six line rest is doing great and uh, there's the firefish right there who's also doing well. So as you can see I've done some changes to the layout I'm now going to have my left hand side or the left side of my uh, landscape or aquascape is all going to be uh, Ophelia uh, species of corals so frog spawn and hammer and maybe a torch yeah, um, you can see I've, I have a couple of new pieces as well I bought this piece here today and two more which are, are on the bottom I've also bought uh, today here's a few of the existing ones I think they're doing quite well so the top is um, s just different species of stony corals uh, SPS but I'm not I don't think they're doing too well except for that Monty uh, piece there's a whole bunch of frags at the bottom which I'm going to be gluing in the next couple of days um, as you can see I've also glued the Recordia all to one rock and I'm pretty pleased with the results and my right hand side is going to be all other corals, soft corals primarily uh, zoanthids if, as well as a few others so you can see there's two candy canes and Duncan as well anyways this is just a quick update I plan to do some rescaping and there's going to be a next video where I'm gonna show the new results notice the presence of the coralline algae in the back I think it does look pretty cool I can't wait till uh, it covers the whole thing